and welcome to Symphony for Happiness. One alternative dwelling I've lived in is a yurt, which is a canvas dwelling with a wooden frame. I did that for around six months, pitching it in a friend's garden after they responded to my tongue-in-cheek advert. What I wanted from the experience was to live in the most basic and ecological way possible for me, while still working as a musician and teacher. So I made furniture from reclaimed materials and began learning to make my own clothes. A wood burner provided the heat for the dwelling and for water and to dry clothes. Water was hauled in and used sparingly. Candles from the car boot were the only form of lighting and I travelled only by bicycle at the time so all aspects of my life were made as simple as possible. Although this basic way of living was very hard going, no electricity or internet, no running water, no insulation, it was an incredible joy for me. I remember feeling utterly at peace just to wake up inside that yurt on a sunny morning, hearing the sounds of nature outside and seeing the shadows of leaves playing on the canvas roof. It's really hard to describe without experiencing it. I do miss my yurt these days and if I had the opportunity I'd get another one, double skinned this time, and live in it. It was an amazing life-changing experience so if you're thinking of living somewhere other than a house I'd recommend looking into a yurt or trying a yurt. Play like you've forgiven yourself